My name is Wendell Pritchett. I have the great honor of serving as the new provost of the University of Pennsylvania. It's my great pleasure to welcome you to the second, this is our second of, of many, Penn, uh, annual Penn Integrates Knowledge uh, Roundtable Discussions, organized by our PIK professors, uh, which we call PICs. As you may know, the PIC program was created in 2005 to recruit renowned professors to Penn who are appointed in two or more schools. This is a way to, to uh, break down silos and really accelerate the great research that we're doing at Penn. So distinguished by the diversity of their research and teaching, each PIC professor has a unique area of focus. But what they share is a deep desire to solve complex problems, real world problems by working across fields. This approach is vital to modern teaching, research, and scholarship, and it's vital to the Penn education. It's vital to our success at Penn. So each PIC professor with us today will touch on one or knowing them many, several, aspects of the health disparities that continue stubbornly to plague not just our own country, but global health. Health disparities are preventable differences in the burden of disease, injury, and longevity, you all know that. And more than that, in the opportunity for everyone, including minority and other disadvantaged groups, to achieve optimal health. I think you'll agree this is a very timely topic. Unfortunately, it's becoming even more timely. So in order of their presentations, and we're going to bring them up right now, Karen Glanz, the George A. Weiss University professor who studies epidemiology and nursing. Sarah Tishkoff, the David and Lynn Silfen University professor who studies genetics and biology. And my colleague, Dorothy Roberts, the George A. Weiss University professor who studies law and sociology. Again, thank you all for being here. It's really important work that we're doing, and this is going to be a great discussion that I know will generate lots of other uh, fruitful interactions. So thank you, and please join us.